clue. What do you got there? A sandwich. Let's see that? What kind? Ham and cheese. Not bad. So what are you doing in the park? Eating my lunch. All alone? Yeah, is that all right? Good for you. Gives you time to think. Want a nip? No thanks. Like they say, it's five o'clock somewhere. I'll pass just the same. Suit yourself. Thanks for not running away. Sure. Thanks for not killing me. Excuse me? N nothing. Sorry. What makes you think I'd run away? Everybody does. As soon as they see me coming or not long after I sit down. Well, you haven't given me a reason to leave. I don't intend to. It's just a social stigma, you know? Dirty on the outside means dirty on the inside. Unemployed means lazy. That's ridiculous. Maybe, but that doesn't stop it from happening every day. At least till now. Stereotypes, we'll judge a book by its cover. I guess I understand. I get the same thing. Well, not exactly the same, but kind of. Yeah. How so? I work in an office setting, so I have to dress up on a daily basis. Yes. And sometimes I get stuck working late, so I'll stop up for a drink after work, you know, happy hour, something like that. Sure. And I can't help but think people avoid me because of how I'm dressed. What's wrong with what you're wearing? Oh, nothing. But I get the feeling people see me as sort of straight-laced, you know, a snob. So usually I don't talk to anyone. Well, look at the bright side. At least you can get into those places. I'm lucky if I can milk a cup of coffee and some dive. I guess that's true. Ironic, isn't it? You can get into those places, but you don't meet anyone. I can't get in, but I meet all kinds of people out on the street. Kind of an interesting trade-off. You're not really what I expected. Not an illiterate bum, you mean? No, I didn't mean it like that. But can I ask you something? Let me guess. How'd I end up like this? Well, yeah, I mean, if you don't mind saying. You seem like a very intelligent man. I was an attorney. Really? Criminal defense. I was gonna change the world. Defend the innocent from the great oppressive justice system. Free the unjustly accused. Be the heroic savior of the common man. So, what happened? That is... I started believing my own PR. What do you mean? I had a client that I knew was guilty, but I couldn't stand the thought of losing, so I... Of course, to witness the alibi him, get him off. Pushed harder than I should have. What, did you get caught? I had. No, no one ever found out. 
He was acquitted. A week later, he raped and murdered a 12-year-old girl. Oh, my God. They caught him and put him away, life sentence. Couldn't get that girl's mother out of my mind. I keep seeing her there in the courtroom like an empty shell. Someone whose soul had been ripped out and shredded. I did that. Hey, you, you couldn't have known, could you? You think that made a difference, that little girl? Or to her mother? I don't know what to say. After that, I just fell into a bottle and never came out. You think he's dirt, don't you? That he can't possibly be any kind of respectable man. Will you listen to me? Because I am a respectable man, and he's innocent. Innocent, I say. End this travesty of justice and acquit this poor man. This victim of the system, this, this... vicious, murdering bastard. I'm sorry. I, d I didn't mean to. We were just talking and I thought I'd ask. It's okay. I'm Not your fault. I'm the one who's sorry. Besides, it's not all that bad. I, I do what I want, when I want. I don't have to answer to anyone. There's some peace to be had in there. I never thought about that. Of course not. You're not going to think about the upside of something you never had to experience. You've had a lot of time to think about it. Oh, uh, I totally lost track of time. Um, I didn't. That big clock over there, it's almost gone. I'm awfully sorry. I, uh, I really have to go. Um, Victor. Nice to meet you, Victor. I'm Jill. Jill, it was great meeting you. Um, hey, it's not much, but I'd like for you to have it. Thanks, Adam. That's okay. Stay, let me give you something. It's a new play down at the Audubon Theater. Enjoy. But, what, what's it about? It's about redemption. Of an attorney who becomes a homeless alcoholic after being consumed by guilt. I hear the lead actor really gets into his role. Oh, really? I'm an actor.